Boys and Laughs Grow What It Do. And so today we're making a roast. As you can see, I have seasoned it pretty. Uh, excuse the noise in the background. I have company, family here. But anyway, we're going to just go on past them. And look at this roast. I have cut up and diced up all of my, look at my garlic cloves, the green pepper, celery, red peppers, orange peppers, red onions, yellow onions, and my potatoes. And so at the um, last part of getting ready to uh, prep my roast and put it in the oven, I just wanted to show you the last few parts of it, okay? So now I'm going to put my potatoes around my roast. Now usually I would have carrots as well but i don't have any carrots i was not able to get any carrots i was tired today and so we're not doing any carrots my daughter doesn't like carrots anyway right so she's not gonna be upset and again you know you just work with what you have sometimes and as long as you cook it with love and give it a nice seasoning and everything it'll still be fine Okay, so there are my potatoes. And so now what I'm going to do now is just give a light season to my potatoes. My meat is seasoned really good, as you can see. And so I'm just going to go over my potatoes with a little seasoning salt. Just a little sprinkle because we don't want our potatoes bland. Okay, and this is a little garlic powder on my potatoes. Okay. Then we have our onion powder on the potatoes. All right. And then we have a little black pepper. And we're going to sprinkle that on our potatoes. Okay. Fun fact. Did you know that Miss Aretha, the queen of soul, I saw a video where she said she did not like black pepper. But we all know that she could cook, but she didn't like black pepper. All right, isn't that a fun fact? Okay, so now I'm going to just put my onions. And you're going to put it all, just put it all over your food. Okay. It's going to all cook in and all the flavors of your onions and all that good stuff. I'm trying to keep my my um, camera steady. So please excuse me if it's not as steady as it should be. Okay. Put in the onions, the red onions, all over. Okay. Now we're going to put our mixed peppers all in your potatoes and all over your meat and we're going to put the rest of it as you can hear we have laughter in the background isn't it great to have your family and just you know and just everything is fine and not everything is fine but you know you just still find a reason to smile and laugh you just you know we're blessed everything is not always fine I'm not going to sit up here and pretend everything is fine, but we're still blessed, right? Right. I know I'm blessed, and I thank God for food on my table. Now, look at that. That looks good. I'm telling you the flavor that is going to be in this food. And so now I'm just going to take my little garlic cloves and stick it into the sleeves or the slits of the meat. Find little crevices and stick your garlic cloves inside okay and just stick it inside the meat all right just like so and it's going to really give your meat a nice flavor usually i will um cut it but i'm just not going to cut it i'm just going to find little slits and stick them in okay and it's still going to be fine all right that's enough. All right, so now what I'm going to do is to get some water and put it in the pan. You just coat the bottom of the pan with the water, put it foil on top. I have my oven preheated at 350, and then uh, we're going to put it in the oven, okay? And so let's do that.
I'm going to be back when the roast is ready and show you the roast all done. Okay? Thank you so much for watching Arts and Laughs. This is the art of making a delicious roast. This is how I do mine. How do you do yours?